everybody and welcome to Gaming with Zombie. Zombie here and today we are playing Dark Souls 3, which is really a terrible idea on my part because I am uh, not the best, not the best at all. Uh, not only that, but I'm also playing with a janky controller that likes to just go off on its own direction sometimes. Um, <clears throat> I have gotten a grand accumulated total of about two and a half hours worth of practice in this game. So, we're looking at what's basically going to be an absolute clusterfuck. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and make our character. I... The other playthrough that I have done, playthrough, the other start of the game that I've done, I was a warrior? Yeah, I was a warrior, um, which was nifty, but I don't know if it's necessarily what I want to do this time around. Uh, I sort of like hating myself, so I'm very tempted to be one of the deprived. <clears throat> Let you sort of just do whatever you want. You you get to put your stats where you want them to go. These are all like really nice things. But that first boss is a fucking pain in the ass. I usually end up playing uh, very much so like my, my well, usually I've only done this once. Uh, I ended up with a lot of heavy armor like this. So, it's hard to say. I feel like I might be a little bit better off doing this. Mm. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. So, uh, these things don't really matter. No. Yes. Let's be a lady. Oh, man. Look how smexy that is. What with the lack of being able to tell. You know what? Dark Souls 3, uh, if no one else has, I would like to be the first one to let you know, hey, good job on actually doing uh, no difference in the armors. I'm very proud of you. High fives for you. Let's see. Lots of souls. Greatly increases item discovery for a little while. Don't care. Don't care. Mm, let's see. I feel like life ring is a good decision. So we're going to go with that. Build burly upper body. No. Standard's good. I like standard on that one. Face presets, that's fine. Let's do skin color. And we're gonna do... We could be Majin Buu. Or colloidal silver. I like colloidal silver colored better. Or... She-Hulk. Since we're playing a warrior, I feel like She-Hulk might be the better option here. She's usually bright green. Yep, that looks about right. Now, ah, oh, god diggity damn it. There we go. She also kind of looks a little bit like Elphaba. If I ever wanted to do like a sorcerer <laughs> or caster of some sight some type. I don't know if you people even know who that is. That's the Wicked Witch's name. There we go. Yep. Perfect. Do we want hair? I don't care. Uh, whatever. Alright. I think we're good. Let's finalize our creation. Oh, we need a name. We need a name. Uh, 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 She-Hulk it is. Because, why not? So let's do this! Um, hopefully, I will not embarrass myself too terribly badly. 
There's no way of knowing that for sure. But, uh, hopefully that'll be the case. For whom the bells toll. I don't actually remember that song. Uh, maybe it would be an, a better idea to not, whoa. Did I miss this? And I don't remember this. Hmm. That's a thing. I zombied myself up out of the ground. Hell yeah. All right, so these are basically just the uh, how-tos for the game. Not bad. Got a nice little bit of dash. Very groovy. Just go and collect these here souls. Got a good bit of uh, stamina, too. Damn. I almost feel like... Uh, I almost feel like this character is maybe a little bit stronger than the uh, warrior was. Because I seem to remember the warrior taking a few hits to uh, take anybody down. Although that could be my imagination, but I don't think it was. Nice fast attacks, too. I think this is a... Uh, one of the easier characters to play as, if I'm not mistaken. I think that's a, a general consensus by a lot of folks. Hey, don't tag me. It's my first time to get a hit. Not too shabby. So, there's a big spoopy scary boss guy over here. I feel like I'm probably not equipped to take them on at this point. So I'm just going to come up here and grab these souls and then move on till I'm just a little bit stronger. Because he hits hard and it hurts. Bye, buddy. It's good seeing you. I miss you already. Woo. See ya. I think I read that there's some sort of weapon hidden up there, but I really don't know. I don't think there is, just because this is like the startup training area, but I feel like I saw something along those lines, that there's a, an interesting weapon hidden up there someplace. It's probably somewhere else, and I'm just confusing it because that's where the crystally monster thing is. Bonfire got lit, son! All right, now we're rested up. Okay, leave groovy. So once I get, uh, that was weird. There we go. You have no idea how many times it took me to get that shit down packed. The answer is it was a lot. We good, fam? Don't you worry about it. Don't you worry your pretty face. Man, I'm actually really impressed with how the knight plays. This is very, very impressive. It's so easy. So much easier. There, That was one of the things where my uh, controller was trying to go in a weird direction. This is so much easier. I, I think I've, it's also I've had about an hour, two hours worth of practice. But this is going so much easier than the other uh, class. And some BAMs. We got BAMs, baby. BAM! That's Zimra Lagasse quotes. Is he dead? Is he still alive? I don't remember anymore. Anywho, that's not the point. So let's see if we can take down the first boss, or the tutorial boss. Get some of my stam back up. Oh wait, I still have to pull the cord. 
pull the cork as it was. All right, let's do this. Oh, please don't be shitty. Please don't suck. I'm gonna be real sad camper if I suck. <clears throat> hey, buddy. Hey. Okay, Paso fam. Can't touch this. Dun, 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 dun. Can't touch this. Ow, he touched this. Oh, he touched the shit out of this. He hella touched me in very no no places. about that shit balls ouch my face oh come on man we were doing so good don't take this from me don't take this from me. I was so proud of myself for a second. took me like oh I don't know 15 tries 20 tries 25 tries to get to that fucking point before Jesus God that shit was hard the first fucking time <sighs> so this is my first Dark Souls game that's my excuse for his suckage. So if anybody has a problem with it, eat a dick. It's my first fucking time. Not the eat, not, mm, you know what? Ignore that last thing that we were talking about. Anywho, the point of that story is that, uh, yeah, stuff and things. Ow. I could have technically blocked you, but I didn't want to. I just wanted to kill you for that sweet, sweet soul. Homeward bone, if you know what I'm saying. Hey, alrighty. That guy looked like he had a striped cloak on, which was kind of weird. So, let's see. That's right, the guys are right here. I did a lot of farming to try and like get good and I think I've, I've gotten a lot better I'm not good I'm not good at all I'm not good at any video games that I do to be perfectly legitimate uh, but I feel like I'm doing a lot better than I did for sure when I was trying to learn you know base mechanics of the games I don't usually look into the games beforehand a lot of times I just turn games on give them a go and see how it goes because I feel like a lot of what I do is first impression shit not first impressions ever for the game but my first impression because that is interesting to see me freak the fuck out over creepy spooky demon dog things um but not everybody's into that so whatever I, I wanted to be decent enough to not immediately make a fool out of myself on the interwebs when I played this so yeah, I actually got in a couple hours of practice and 
Learned some of the mechanics. I still suck, though, so that's a thing. Remember it. Hey. Hey, lady. Well, thank you. Um, I tend to the flame and tend to thee. Tend to me, if you know what I'm saying. But to this end, I am at thy side. Sweet. So now we've officially unlocked the ability to level then ourselves up. Then touch the darkness within me. I'm totally going to touch that darkness inside of you, if you know what I mean. Sounds really dirty. Well, because it is dirty, but that's not the point. Again, stop. You're getting us off track. Yeah. So, um, my highest stats are strength, vitality, and vigor. Since my vitality is good for right now, because I can move along fairly easily, I think vitality has something to do with the speed at which you can move while you're wearing armor. Um, so I am more inclined to level up my strength to increase my dablage. That's important to me. Okay. So now I can stab this thing. Embed the coiled sword. Can I use the coiled sword instead? Because that looks like a really cool thing. I would like to be able to use the coiled sword to kill things. It'd be sweet. Alright, so let's move on to the next section. Let me tell you, holy shit, I've gone so much further, so much faster with the knight than I did... Oh my gosh. Literally, this is where I am. This is where I am, basically. I'm one bonfire forward from where I currently am right now. So... I don't know if that's because I've been practicing or if it's because this is a better character for me personally to play because that's my playstyle. Because what I've noticed is Dark Souls seems to be very heavily, very, very heavily influenced by the way that you choose to play games. Uh, very similar to how Skyrim ended up being. In fact, I would say that this game has some similarities to Skyrim in regards to the ability to sort of play the way that you want to play. And that's a really good thing. That's actually excellent. The fact that you can sort of do what you want to do uh, with your character, especially because they have an option to make a character that has, you know, the exact same starting stats and you can modify them however you like. Um, you know, with all that in mind, it, it very much so gives you the sort of free reign to play however you like, which is really quite excellent. We're going to just go over here. I'm being followed, aren't I? Yep. What's up, pups? No. Nope. You dead, fool. Ooh, you are gross. You are very gross. Ooh. Just want to... Oh, is that my move? Nice. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and end the episode. Thank you everybody for watching. I hope that you've enjoyed it. If you have, make sure you leave me a like down below. If you have something interesting or witty to say, put that in the comment section. Uh, check out our subscribe button. It's down there floating on top of the brains. Click that. You'll be kept informed of whenever we put up new videos. Uh, so that's a fun thing. You can also find us on Facebook and Twitter at GWZombie. And uh, last but not least, hey, do you see all of these videos that are popping up on the side of the screen there? Uh, one of those is going to be what YouTube thinks that you like to watch on my channel. So go ahead and click that. That's going to be the bottom video. And the top video is going to be whatever new thing just came out recently. Maybe another series or something along those lines. So anyway, thank you all for watching, and we will catch you in the next episode. Bye-o!